I've been doing music now almost 20 years, if not more, with no complaints, no regrets. I knew at an early age what the sacrifice would be, that I could end up being an old person with nothing, trying to be an artist, do whatever. But the fact of the matter is, over a period of time, it starts becoming a pursuit, and it just becomes an identity. You realize that no matter where you are and what you're doing, you're always thinking about that next song you're going to write. You see, you're having conversations with people, and you're thinking about, oh, this would be a good movie idea. You turn everything into a comic book, and you actually write these comics. You're the person who does sculptures or whatever. And people always take that, like, you know, the ones who have gotten lucky or the ones who have worked with people for a long time. And then they like to try to make this seem like you're being bitter because you're saying what the truth is. But all of this, like, when you really realize that the real gift, and I think old people understand this when it comes to age. Because when you get to be a certain age, you go back and you look like, wow, it really ain't so bad being old having the tools that I have now. And that's what it is when you're a real actual artist. The type of people who understand that, like, Kendrick Lamar won that battle. People who, like, you listen to a lot of people who talk about Drake. And, you know, these are pop artists who are giving pop artists feedback. Uh, Cameron and Mace, oh, yeah, you know, Drake won the battle. Like, of course they won. Drake won because you do pop music. But for people who really are in that struggle, the old person who really got old for real, the artist who really is the artist in real life, we know each other, we see each other. And I'm here to tell you, ain't no freebies. It ain't no freebies. And the real reward, when you talk about, like, when I mention elderly and stuff, the real reward in that is that struggle. It's, it's of knowing that. It's of knowing that what you got, you really did get from the mud. And I feel like a lot of people who are just culture vultures are people who, and let me just segue because I do that a lot because I have to make the video short. This really didn't have nothing to do with Drake or Kendrick Lamar or anybody. I just decided to throw that in there because that's relevant at the time in 2024 when I'm making this comment. But the whole point in reality is that artists like us in real life who are really artists for real, there's no time limit on it. And you don't get no freebies, not even from the universe. Ain't no such thing as no manifestation. And oh, I'm going to call it to existence. So I just had to believe in myself and whatever. It's either going to happen or it doesn't. But if you're an artist, you don't care if it does or not.